in my life, babe. Yeah. I've had most everything in my life, babe. Yeah, girl. girl, I don't have you, baby. My life, baby. Oh, love. I've had riches untold. Yes, I have. Hello, my name is James Taylor, W. James Taylor. I'm from Knoxville, Tennessee. I want to tell you a little bit about my business and my company, Geneva Galleries Incorporated. I started the business maybe close to 30 years ago now. I was a police officer in Knoxville, Tennessee. And during the time, I had an idea about talking about the black experience, but I wanted it to be in such a way that it was beautiful. I didn't want to be a militant about it or anything, but I wanted to talk about the plight of my people. Now I'm still continuing to do vicissitude, but uh, everything that I do in art is pertains to vicissitude or some part of it, the past, the present, or the future. I've been doing a lot of abstract paintings now. As I get older, it seems like uh, I'm going towards the abstract. And I've been doing a lot of abstract paintings representing time in history. For, 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 for an example, I have one called Strange Fruit, which is uh, talks about Southern lynchings. And I have one called Burning Village. These are all subliminal images that I wanted to present in a way to talk about the plight of the black man in the past, but do it in such a way that it's visually beautiful. So that's my emphasis now is to do that. And I purchased my Giclée printing machine. And now I'm publishing other artists. I want to bring artists in to give them an idea about the business and help them over some of the obstacles that they may incur. And what's the name of your business? What's the name of your gallery? Geneva Galleries Incorporated, named after my mom. Her name was Geneva Mathis Taylor. She died at an early age, and uh, when she passed away, I was a police officer, and I told her that one day I was going to have a gallery in her name. And she said, whatever I do, don't stop being the artist that I am. She always wanted me to be an artist, and she was my emphasis for that. She's always been my inspiration. This piece is called Black Water, which represents Middle Passage, which represents the um, what happened to the slaves during the Triangular Slave Route. Some of the slaves would jump overboard and were eaten by the sharks. And there were so many slaves that would jump or either thrown overboard for being sick or whatever. The sharks ate so many bodies that it changed the migration pattern of the sharks in that part of the world. And to this day, these sharks still follow that same slave trade route. These two represent family. The one is called Royal Blue, which is the male. Majestic Gold represents the mother and child. And this represents family when you hang them together. Do what you want to do. And you better go where you want to go, Lord. Why you living, Lord, Lord? Give up your life, what you want to give. Why you living? Ooh, yeah. 